where to begin? First off, after seeing the actions of Carolyn Davies, I am coming to the conclusion that not only does she suffer from night terrors, which we have not been allowed to witness yet, but also from aggressive sleepwalking syndrome. In my opinion, Carolyn Davies is going to have to leave this house and go back where we can perform proper tests. Still, I am not let go of the notion that there is something off about this place. It could be the lack of lighting or this God-forsaken fog that turns day into night. It beats a chill with it. However, I am not cold. Personal log here. Trying to figure out about last night's dream of Sandra. It felt so real, but it had to be a dream. The funny thing is, 